Hello and welcome to another episode of what I was calling learning Japanese through gaming, I think it was, but I think I should give it a different title so that it's more searchable and easier to share with people uh, than just relaying a basic description of what it is. I think I'm going to call it Game Gogakuen, which means a Game Language Study Academy. and. Uh, so hopefully that name sticks, but if it doesn't, we'll figure out a good one. But uh, anyway, I'd like to apologize for the lack of uploads this afternoon. I was trying to stream a session which got cut up into many different pieces that didn't join together, and I think it was due to the stream being interrupted, and I tried again just a few minutes ago and got the same result so I think it may be due to the traffic on Twitch I'm not sure but even the successful session I had this morning uh, which was fully uploaded I tried exporting that to YouTube and even that failed and that had nothing to do with my computer it was all up to Twitch to upload it to my account so um, I guess they must be having some issues uh, with all the traffic they get on Sunday night I know Sunday night's a big internet usage time period, so um, I'll just record offline until then and uh, figure out a way to upload later. So um, we'll kind of pick up in the middle of what I was doing before because it got lost. Um, but basically, I went through my game saves and looked at all the items and took screenshots of them to show you how I take screenshots. And uh, I'll go back over that later uh, in case you want to know how to take screenshots of PlayStation games uh, or any other games in the, on the computer. Um, and then how to crop them, uh, etc. So I'll do some of the cropping and flashcard editing now uh, so you can see how I do that. So uh, just start. We've got 24 images left. Um, I'm not sure how many we started with, but I just went through and deleted them as we went through them. And I didn't make cards for every single sentence uh, that I encountered. Uh, some of them I already had. Usually I check in my browser by typing some of the text. For example, uh, I'll type like the first words and see if it comes up. Okay, I don't have this one, but this short sentence here I'm not going to make a card for because it, I just don't really need to know any of the words in that particular sentence. But uh, hopefully as the live streaming has more success and fewer glitches, uh, if you guys, even if I don't need a card, if you guys would like me to make you a card uh, of a particular sentence, uh, I'll gladly do that. So. Hopefully we can work together on that later. But uh, for now, I'll just go through and make the the cards that I need, and hopefully um, you'll be able to use those after I upload them to Dropbox. So, all right, here we go. So, uh, see if I have a card for this sentence here. Inu ga okori jōtai ni nari, kōgeki roku ga apsuru ga. So it says it puts the dog in an angry state and ups his attack power, but okay, doesn't look like I have a card for that one, but um, there's not really any words in there that I need to know right now, so I'm going to skip that one. Um, the only reason I was checking is in case that I did have a card I would like to upload the image of this medicine, so or this Sylvester Esca, Shirvesta Esca. All right, so I'm gonna delete that one. Go to the next, Anchimon Kasodo, and I'll search for the first few words here. Sensei Anchimon Powder O. Oh, here we go. We got it. Taiden saseta mono de nagetsukete shiyou suru. All 
All right. So I think w there's a, a couple sentences here that we may be able to apply this image to. So what I do to um, crop the image is I just click and drag in Irfan View. Uh, this is just a free image editing program uh, spelled I R F A N B I E W. So I just highlight it, then Control Y, and then S. Control Y crops, and then S will save it. And then I I put the uh, cropped image in this folder called Sized for Anki, and then I just put that in the card. And you'll see later that when I try to put the images in the card, it doesn't give me nice little previews like this. So I have to remember the last four digits and look for those. Uh, as for the quality of the images, I, I just kind of guessed the quality of 85 on the JPEG um, format would be good enough. But uh, if you have any other suggestions on how to optimize these uh, with little quality loss and taking up little space, um, I'm open to suggestions. So, so I'm going to remember the last four digits are 1806. All right, so I'm going to click the image field and then click attach pictures or audio or video. 1806, here it is. See, I don't know how to make it uh, give me a preview image, so I just have to remember the number. So there it is. Um, now let's, that's basically done. So we'll go back and see if the second sentence. If I already have a card for that. I show me a taru to konaga hajikite kyori opena. Here we go, Hoden Gensho Makiokus. So I do have one of these. Oh, I guess there's also another item that does the same thing. And I guess I did add this image just earlier tonight in that failed broadcast session. Um, so really either image could work. I'm just going to leave that one. Uh, it's not too important. So, alright, we'll delete that one and move on. Renkin Seizo Yo no Medal. Saiko ni Yoi Sozai. So this is an, a medal for alchemical creations. And it is of the highest good material. There's not really any words here. Um, earlier, I think this morning in this successful upload, um, we did the word Denkin Jutsushi, which is alchemical technology or alchemical art uh, person of knowledge. And so that's that's close enough. I don't really need to memorize every every word that contains this linking uh, compound but uh, anyway uh, sorry if I skip over this and you're wanting a card for it hopefully during the live streams in the future um, I'll be able to ask for your input uh, this has got the same the same first line here uh, a metal for use in alchemical creations this is a Sobi item, ke Sozai. So this is equipable items, material for equipable items. And uh, Sobi means to equip. I think I've got a card with Sobi. Yeah. Tokutate no item o Sobi chu, sore o nagittari, jime ni oku kodo ga dekimasu. So I've already got a card for Sobi, so I'm just going to skip this one. And it's not really a sentence that gives me a whole lot of context, so I'm just gonna move on. So, sorry. Uh, this is a bronze figure. I don't know if I have a card for this one. Sorry, I, I might say that a lot, but a lot of these I made so long ago, I'm not really sure if I have cards for them. Okay. Yes, I have this card. Great. I've actually reviewed it eight times. I think I remember it by now. So, um, by the way, what I just did here, um, 
I'm in the process of sort of future proofing my cards. Right now, the default um, hint for closed deletions is three periods. Uh, and so I didn't have anything special as a hint. But uh, just in case the developer of Anki decides to change what the default hint is, I don't want my uh, three character card, uh, three character closed deletions to be affected, so I'm trying to add those three dots in to specify if that's the type of hint that I want. Uh, so anyway, that's why I did that. So we'll go ahead and crop this one. I don't think I have an image for it. Nope. Okay. Just click and drag. I like that it has these nine little sections that help you center the image. Um, it's pretty helpful. So, control Y, S, the last four digits are 1913. So, remember, we'll be using that when we attach the image. 1913, there it is. And usually it comes up at the bottom if you do them in order. Um, just because the edit names follow the, the order of the screenshots in the parent folder or parent folder or the original I don't know 1440p folder so usually they'll be the, it'll be the last image but just in case I like to take note of those last four digits so all right so that one's done so I'll do that go on I don't Sorry. Bomb man. Oh, Seizurashiki mono ga horare tiru. Sky Michi wa yoku wakarane. Alright, so we got this one. So it's the Gin no Enban. So a metal plate, a silver metal plate. And another thing I showed in in the uh, previous tutorial that didn't stream correctly is why these kind of look stretched, and uh, it's because I'm playing the game with the 3D models in widescreen, but everything 2D gets kind of stretched like this. So um, maybe it's not the the best solution. To do it like this, but uh, I don't know. I could be making a huge mistake. But I've already done a lot of them like this, so I'm just gonna keep keep going. funny though that some of these look just right like for example this one doesn't look stretched at all so I mean the circle here looks really good so I don't know it's hard to keep it consistent it seems like so anyway I'll just keep keep going like I am and if these images bother you um, I'm sure we can resize them in batch later. So. Ready to. Ready to medallion. Thinking says, Oh, you're the medal. So that's the same sentence as all the other medallions. So we item K. So that. So this is another equipable item uh, material. We'll delete that one. Now, Kenja no Yaringu. I don't know. If, I don't recognize that one. Let's see. Kishu. No. No, we don't have that one. Okay. Looks like we got ourselves a new card. So, let's change the deck to Japanese sentences. That's just the sentence deck that I put all of my Japanese sentences in and try to tag appropriately. 
Alright, let's tag Demento, title of the game. Kishona Kenja no Ishi O Kako Shite Skrita Yaringu. Alright, that's good. So we'll change it to Japanese. I can't remember if I explained this one in a good stream or in the messed up stream, but with this program, in order to get the readings to be generated, I have to switch the type to Japanese and then back to closed type. So don't ask me why, it's just the way it's set up. So um, now I just gotta figure out what word I wanna learn. So Kisho I guess I'll learn that one. I mean I already have cards for Kenja, Kako, and Yuring is just so close to English I don't think I'm gonna forget it. So I'm gonna highlight that, control shift C and then add in my hint. But you see if I type it in Japanese it looks weird and I don't think it works correctly as a hint, so I have to change it to the half size characters. So the hint will be the fact that it's two characters. And now I'll go get the definition from the dictionary in Japanese. So, kiwamete made de sukunai koto sama. So, having the appearance or it actually being extremely rare and few in number. I'm just gonna do away with the sama and just leave the koto. I like kanji, so I'm going to put that in. Then I'll add kanji for mare. Alright. I, I only added the reading for mare just because it's not as common as kiwameru or sukunai. So, um, I might need to refresh my memory there. So now we'll get the English definition of Kisho. Scarcity. Alright. Now we'll make the image. That one doesn't look too stretched, I guess. Alright. So that's good. Control Y to crop. And then S to save. Take note of the last four, 2018. Attach 2018. There we go. Got ourselves a card. Now I'll check the other stuff. Panic. Panic. Chi no kaifuku speedo ga ya ya hayamaru hoka. Kogeki o kita toki no panic. Chi no joshu o skoshi yawaragiru. So. Basically, it recovers the recovery speed of your panic value is a little bit sped up, and other than that, your uh, the attacks that you that befall you um, they uh, don't cause your panic value to rise as much. So it kind of relieves a little bit the rise of your panic meter when you've attacked. So, I don't know. No, so I have to check. It doesn't look like we have a card for that one either. So, we'll make one. Okay, so panic chi no kai fuku speed the speed of recovery for a panic value. Yeah, 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 a little bit. Somewhat. Ayamaru. Okay. 
攻撃を受けたとき、逃げるタクの谷口の上昇。It's a rise in your panic meter when you get when you receive an attack. So, Scotchy, Yawaragadu. It softens a little bit the rise in your panic meter. Okay, now we'll get the reading from that by switching to Japanese type and then going back to close type so that I can use Control Shift C. Now, what do I want to learn? Um, what don't I have a card for? <sighs> I mean, I guess I know these. Yeah, yeah, I, I don't use very much, so why don't I learn that one? It's kind of simple because there's not even any kanji to it, but um, and I'll put that it's not squishy. You know, we'll practice using. We're coming up with the word yaya in our heads. So I like to do that even if I know a word, if I don't use it in my active vocabu vocabulary very much, I like to practice coming up with it. So, kind of. To a certain. Somewhat. Yeah. I like that one. Somewhat. Go back to the Japanese definition. The quantity or degree is very little. And it's not skoshi.、Uh, I can't remember if I explained this already in a good video or if it was in the canceled video, so I'll go ahead and explain it again. Basically, I count the hints with periods and X's. Period means that you don't get a hint. For that one, it could be anything, and it's one character. And then the X means that there's another character, but it's not she, so it's not Skoshi. So that'll give me a hint not to type Skoshi and then be disappointed in myself that I didn't come up with Yaya.、Yeah, yeah. So I'll just have to think of something that doesn't have she as the second character. Okay, now we'll go back and get the image. I could add the image again, but I'm not sure if that'll create a duplicate.、Uh, if anybody knows, feel free to let me know. But the way I do it is like this. So I already have the image here. I know that if I copy and paste it, it references the same image in my collection multimedia folder or media folder.、Um, so that way it doesn't waste space and it points to the same file. So add that. And、we're done with that image. Bronze figure. So I already did this one, but I was just going through my game saves one at a time and I didn't remember every one that I took a screenshot of. So that's why the duplicates like that.、Um, and then I made one of this already too. So delete that. And I'm going to search for this one. Shiroi. No, don't have one. Okay, well, that's exciting because let's make sure that there's a word I need to know in here. Shiroi reiseki kara rensei sareta bushitsu. Chi no yona akai o iro o shiteiru. Alright, so I guess that one's kind of easy. So, a white、um, spiritual rock.、Uh, Okay, let's practice my on the fly interpreting skills. So,、um, so, a material that was refined from a white spiritual rock and has a, co has a color、uh, red like blood.、Um, I, I don't really think there's anything in there for me to. Practice. I think I already got Beiseki here. I guess I don't have Beiseki as a, a target word. Let's see if that's even 
a real word or if it's just a word. Well, I guess it is. It was just a word that this game came up with. Basic. Well, it doesn't really give me any definition of it, so. I don't know if I'll ever come across it in real life, so I'm just gonna leave it as it is. Then say, I'm just gonna make sure that I have that one. Yep. Okay, strengthened or cultivated. So, delete that one. アルファベットが印刻印されたブレード So a metal plate a thin metal plate that has been inscribed with alphabetical characters It's pretty easy so I'm going to delete that one or delete the image Okay 国用石の彫刻 this one, not sure. It sounds familiar. Obri no kukyo seki ga ashira wareta choka. Yes. So I already have one for this, and I've got an image. So that's okay. And let me copy this so I don't have to make another image. And search for the second sentence. Azoto. Yeah. の報酬を抑える効果があり、ルミネシンスの追跡から流れやすくなる。So it's, uh, it has the effect of suppressing the release of azoto. Azoto? I don't, I don't know what that would be in English. Uh, but whatever your character releases it, it sort of dampens that a bit and then it uh, makes it easier to escape from the luminescence which are the little lights that follow you around the level um, so oh and I've already got the image there so we're good so move on sasami jaki So, kunsei is not an easy word, but uh, I think I've already got a card for that. Yeah. This one. Oh. Yeah. Well, this is where it belongs. So, we'll go ahead and take a shot of that. Two, three, four, five. Go we'll get that. Okay. Sasami. I wonder what sasami is. I'll look that up. Niwatori no Kyobu? So, I don't even know if I read that right, but chicken breast that is of a high quality, very soft and not much fat. So, I guess that's what sasami is. I guess I could make a card from that. Uh, that's okay. If it's not in a sentence, if it's just a word, just out there with no context, uh, I'm not a big fan of making a card of it, but I guess I could put it in here. Yeah. That looks alright. So, 
That's good. Beef jerky. I think we already did this one. Yeah. Did that one. And I guess I could just make it like the other one. But the title is what it is. Okay, moving on. Kongo uh, Seki no Choka. So diamond Choker. Sue no Daiya Mundo. Sue no. Maybe I misspelled that. No? Guess I don't have a card for this one either. So. Let's make one. I'll go ahead and type this one. Kongo Siki. No Shoka. Chika. Shoka. Misu. Ah. No Dai. Diamond. Chili. Bamerita. Chili Bamerita. I don't know what that word is. So I guess that's going to be the word I close out. Choka. Alright. So we can make another card for the other sentence. Get the readings generated. Alright. Kongo Seki no Choka. Musu no Diamond ga Chiribamerareta Choka. Chiribameru. What is that? Oh, maybe Chiri, like, spread out and then Hameru. Like, set in there. Chiribameru. Wow, and there's a kanji for it. Set. Inlaid, set with diamonds. Alright, well apparently the kanji is this, and not the kanji that they gave me, which was that. So, who to believe? Who to believe? I'll believe the dictionary. And that's pretty cool kanji. So set with All right, let me change that shiribame right, let me generate the reading again Alright, so let's get the Japanese definition. Oh, here it is. Hotte Gingin Hoseki Nado Hamekonde Kazaru Mata Hotte Hotte Hamekom Chira 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 Hamekom Bichiriku Chiribam I like that inlaid word. Inlaid with. Let's see if there's any other good definitions. Oh, here we go. Yeah. That one. That may give it away though. Kingin Hoseki Nado Ichimen ni Chirasu Yoni Hamikomi. Oh, and this covers the other meaning too. Mata hiyu teki ni bunshou no tokoro tokoro ni utsukushii kotoba nado. What was that? What is that? What is that? Forgot how to say that. Majieru. Alright. Oh, I can't go back. Shiribamaru. Uh,
Yeah, I don't want to give it away with this definition here because it's got the Chiru, Chirasu, and Hamekomu. So I'm going to go with this one. Hotte, so to carve, and then to carve, and then have something like decorated with gold or silver inlaid. So, alright, I'm happy with that one. Kingin, I think that's how you read that one. Let me see. Kingin! Kin to gin! Alright, pretty easy to remember. Put that. Gold and silver. Kazaru, I think I'll remember, but I'll just add the reading anyway. Kazaru. Alright, that's a crazy kanji. See if I have that image already. I may. So if possible, there we go. I'd like to not make duplicate images that are mostly similar. So I'm just going to use that one. Alright. Good. Now let's search this set, second sentence. Kaiyoku no shoumo. No. Okay, let's make a new card for that too. Let's make sure there's a word in here I need to know. Kaiyoku no shoumo okiku osae. Kaifuku sokudo wa nibai ni sara ni damage jyotai ni naranaku naru. So, the chipping away of your physical energy uh, is lessened greatly and your recovery speed is twice as much as it was and you won't uh, you won't go into a damaged state you won't be able to go into a damaged state uh, yeah I, I don't think I need any words from that so I'm gonna go ahead and Move on. So, Renkin Jutsu Shi no Earring. Let's see. I remember doing this card earlier today uh, for the earrings themselves, but. Yujika. Oh, Katadota Prachina no Earring. So, we already have a card for this. Great. So, all I need to do is use the image so I need to find here they are so that way I don't have to crop this over again make my deck even larger than it needs to be so alright nope let me fix this feature proof this Paste that. Now let's search the last sentence. So this basically uses the same word as some of the other items. There's not really any that I need to learn. So again, this is um, the recovery speed of the panic value is greatly increased and the, the rise of your panic value when you receive an attack is much relieved or much abated. I, I guess that's the word. Um, but yeah, I don't think I need any words from that one. So, I'm gonna move on. 
powder shoes. Oh, okay. Let's see. I think this one was in my sized for Anki folder for some time. And I hadn't been able to use it, so hopefully I'll be able to use it. And You know what is this word? I don't have this one, and I have no idea how to read that. That's gonna know. We shall see. That's key. You know. Alright, we'll stop there. Give the other sentences a chance to give us some words we don't know. Hakkanuno. Is that a word? Hakkanuno. No, the hakka might be. Yes. Hio hasseru koto. Moedasu koto. So, dispatching fire or bringing to burn. Alright. That's a cool word. I didn't know that one. So, all the other ones I pretty much know. So, what is this in English? An outbreak of a fire. Catching fire, igniting. Yeah, all right. So, material or fabric that catches fire or ignites. Igniting fabric, it's called. It's this material called igniting fabric that when used, uh, that was used to make the boots boots that were made from the use of material called igniting fabric. Alright, again, sorry my off-the-dome translations may not be publishing worthy, but I just do my best to try to, you know, give everybody a sense of what I'm reading just in case you don't understand the words that are coming out of my mouth. So, what's his name says? Okay. Let's see. How does shoes? Oh, no. All right, so we gotta make an image here. Let's do it. I like this. I'm sorry. Oh wait, I already have one. Duh. All right. Yeah, that's why I was so excited. Is that it? Yes, it is. Okay. Great. Let's add that. Now let's see. We have a card for this one, for the next sentence. Kibak se. Kibak se o mots. Hakkane no. To tai shogutsu no. Sesh shogu ni yori. Moji dori. Where, where did I leave off? Moji dori. Okay, yep. Same. Bakats de gina koge kiryoku o hakki suru koto ga aru. So. Explosivity is that word. So. Igniting. Uh, fabric that has explosivity and when it touches the target object uh, just as the name suggests an explosive attack power is exhibited oh, alright great now you got the definition of that one so we just need to add that image. So I'm going to add it the way I've been adding it. Just 
just by highlighting, copying, and pasting. Again, doing it this way and selecting the same source may do the same thing. I just don't want it to add a duplicate image into my media folder in my collection and have needless space wasted that way. I'm just going to do it like that for now because I know that points to the same file. So, alright, done with that one. Yosei no earring. Mikazuki. O katadotta junkinsei no earring. Alright, so we got that one. But we don't have the image, so, but maybe we do. Yosei. This is a fairy. Okay. Got it. You go back to the other card. Mikazuki Okatadotta. So, a pure gold made earrings that take the shape of the crescent moon. Here it is. Let's see if we got this other sentence. Hachido Mate. Nope. Really? I thought I had that one. Hiona. No, still got that. Yeah, I got that one. Tachi domatte iru toki. Tomatte iru aida. Dake, Fiona no sugata ga kiete teki ni hakken sare naku naru. Alright. So. Yeah. Okay. Oh, five left. Any duplicates? Nope. Looks like we're going to be doing them all. Maybe. Fudo bottles. I don't know if I have any cards. Oh, here we go. Ga katadorareta. Katadorareta junginse no earring. So pure silver earrings that were made in the shape of Ouroboros, whoever that is. Who's that dude? Alright. Panakuchi no kaifuku speedo ga yaya hayamaru. So the speed of recovery of your panic meter or panic value is somewhat sped up. So we've already got this one. Oh, it's the Tankyusha no Yuri. Yeah, so we've got an image of that. We did that earlier today. Again, I don't remember if it was the video that succeeded in uploading or one that failed. But I'm gonna use this image. Kudo Bolos. There it is. Okay, that was easy. Hisui no Choka. Jade Choker. It's nice that they give you the pretty guy for that one. Oh, got it. And the image. Alright, I'll go ahead and copy that just in case we have more cards already made. We No, you need. No. So we're going to have to make one. But let's make sure we have a word that we need to know. Umi no yo ni fukai ni dori ga accento no choka. So a choker accented with green, deep green. Like the ocean. Uh, no, there's not really any words I don't know there, so let's see if there's any other words here that I might need to study. Taiduk no shomo osai. Kaifuku sokudo ga agaru. So your physical power, uh, it reduces the uh, reduction. I never know how to translate this. Like the chipping away of your HP. So it reduces the chipping away of your HP and your recovery speed is increased. Mata, skoshi dake damage jyotai ni nari ni kuku naru. And also, it uh, makes it harder for you to go into a damage state a little bit. A little bit harder to go into a damage state, which is, I think, where she gets scared and starts running into the wall and other obstacles. So, 
Yeah, I don't think that I'll make any cards more than that one, but I did have a card as you saw for Kisui because I didn't know how to say J. Okay, that's good. Soru no Kagi. Taiyo imi suru. Whatever this is. No, shirushi ga or shimbolu. Orareta. Junkinze no Kagi. So a pure gold key that uh, was uh, etched with the symbol of whatever this is, which means the sun. Soru. That must be S O L. Key of Soul. It's a cool looking key, but I don't really need any of those words here, so I'm going to delete that one. Jo uh, Mon no Kagi, I think. Jo is castle, Mon is gate. Let me make sure. Okay, I don't have that particular word. Oh, now this word, I have no idea what that is. Shin something se no skoshi oki me no kagi. Ittai doko de tsukau mono na no daro. Just where in the world are we going to use this? It is a little on the big side, it's a key a little on the big side made of whatever this is. This right side of this character looks like you and he you. So maybe it's Shinyu? Yeah, I don't know. Oh, there's Shin. Yu. There's the Yu. Yu. I think this search is going to go well. So, let's see. Pretty sure there's a way to look stuff up. Here we go. Search? No. Is this it? Oh, here we go. Alright, so how many strokes is this? Yeah, I don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Man, I don't know. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16? Maybe 16? Anything with metal on the left? Man, I don't know. That's crazy. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Here we go. Come on. If any of you know this word, you get a cookie. Congratulations. This is one crazy word. One crazy kanji, too. Hmm. Did I miss it? That's close. Not it though. Hmm. 
No, that's not it. Man, this is crazy. Nope, that's not it. Barely not it. Alright, uh... Keep looking for a second. Oh, there it is! Woo! Chew! My toe. There we go. Come on! Shinchu! What the heck? Brass! Copy that. I'm not gonna want to look that up again. Shinchu say. Alright. Thank you for bearing with me on that almost fruitless search. So that's how you say brass. Let's see if the reading will get picked up. Yeah, Shinchu say no Scoshi Oki no Kagi. Wow. I wonder if that's in high six remembering the kanji or writing the kanji. It's pretty cool. Brass. Hold on. I'm just trying to find a definition that I can understand because I'm sure it's very technical. Do, do, whatever this is. Maybe American lead? Do no kong ko ko king. Go king? Go king. An alloy thing? Yeah. An alloy, oh, that's a pretty good definition, whatever that was. An alloy of these two. And I'll use that. Okay, and there's another clue. Kako shiasuku sabi nai no de kogyo zairyo nado toshite hiroku mochiiru. So, because it's easy to uh, process and doesn't rust, it is widely used and the uh, as an industrial material. So, all right. So sometimes with difficult cards like this, I have to do definitions and readings within the definition. And that's okay, because it's just kind of a self-sustaining reaction that keeps me learning new stuff. So that was Congo. Nope, go, go key. Okay, okay yep. And I don't know what that is. I'll go ahead. Okay. What is that? Golden color? Maybe? Oh, so keto. Oh, that just means yellow. Okay. Now I'll take that out. Alright, I'm pretty sure that's Do, but I'm just going to check. Okay, Do, Copper. Alright. Okay. Okay, got it. Okay. Or should I... Should it be... Okay, got it. I don't know. What do you think? Hmm. I'm going to go with Akagane.
또 아엔 아엔 That's a weird sounding word. Zinc. Hmm. Okay, and I'm just gonna. I don't like to use English definitions if I can help it, but I could put the chemical symbol. Nah, zinc. Just gonna put zinc. I'm a cheater. Then I'll add what it is. Should have thought of that earlier. Now I might want to go back and change all of my cards to match. to give me a difficult one right at the end here. Alright. Two six three seven. Okay. That was a lot of work for that one card. That's okay. Last one. Metal boots. Metal boots. As you might have guessed. See my section. Ni. Oh yeah, I, I knew I probably wrote that in kanji. See my section. Tetsu no plate ga shikomareta boots. So attacks with kicking are doubled. Uh, doubled in attack power. The kick's attack power is doubled. Mare ni tai shousha o damage jyotai ni suru koto mo. Mare ni tai shousha o damage jyotai ni suru koto mo. And then it trails off. So sometimes, rarely, the the object that you kick, or the person, the object, yeah, the victim, the object person, uh, is put into a damaged state, which I've never seen. So apparently, they can make the enemy run around like you do uh, when you're uh, damaged. Crawling around on the floor, so that would be interesting to see. I didn't know that. Hmm. All right, but really, there's no words in that in these two sentences that I need to learn right now. So, but I've already got a card for this one, so I'm going to use this. All right. That too close up? That's fine. Two six five four. All right, there we go. And shikomareta is built into takumi ni naka ni kumi komu. So built in the middle of something intelligently. All right. We're good. We did it. We made it through all those images. So these are all the ones we made today. Those. Okay. So thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.